People across the nation, they are sounding off on the Wisconsin Interscholastic Athletic Association's rules about student chanting. And as we told you last night at 10, a student athlete is under fire for a tweet that was in response to an email sent by the WIAA. And while the sportsmanship rules are nothing new, as NBC 15's Christy Batista explains, a Northeastern Wisconsin athlete's recent tweet is causing many to be outraged. That's right, guys. Last night, we told you about the student's tweet and how social media experts felt about how the situation was handled. The suspension has a lot of people talking, but here's the thing. The rules have been in place for years. It's no surprise to athletic directors around here. It's common to hear the crowd getting loud at high school basketball games. But what the WIAA expects is positivity. So they sent out an email in December to athletic directors across the state saying what student chants are considered unacceptable. The original email had things in it like air ball, um, you can't do that, things that were maybe more negative, targeting individuals, um, anything negative, we were just reminded that we were really supposed to try to stop it. But it's nothing new to athletic directors. It's been in the handbook since 1997. But recently, a Hilbert High Schooler got a hold of that email and sent out an illicit tweet in response. She was suspended for five games. A lot of people are coming up to me saying, what do you think about this new rule that the WIA is enforcing? And again, it's nothing new. It just blew up because of the student that was suspended. However, some students didn't know how strict the rules really were and say some of them don't make any sense. It's part of the game. It's been a part of the game. You know, you go to a Badger basketball game, you go to any basketball game for that matter, guy airballs it, you know, you're going to yell airball. Since the WIAA rule has resurfaced, it's now getting attention from big names like ESPN and Sports Illustrated, causing more and more people to bring their thoughts to social media. Now, some athletic directors say all of the attention may cause the WIAA to sit down and discuss different rules that might be easier to enforce.